they talk a black. And so the people saw that Hanson was deformed in the mind. And this was not the only son that Ham had, it was just his first son. Ham's children, a lot of Ham's children had this disease because Ham had a disease also. And so they are pink. So how did so many of them come about so fast? How is that? Ham's children, something was wrong with their minds, and they did a breeding. And when the female would have the baby, the male, they were like animals something. The male would lick her. You know, as the males do, the babies now when they do a circumcision, the male would lick her. It just licked the blood, licked the blood, and think, you know, this is the way to, um, you know, to heal her, you know what I'm saying? And they would also have sex with her some more, you know? And so they would have many babies really, really fast. You would be surprised how fast they would have babies. And that's how they became so many of them. And then the, I would say, with the Bible. See, if you're going to deal with the Bible, but it's really to me the melanated people. Because, um, anyway, so the Hebrews decided they needed to do something with them because they could not trust them even around the dogs. And so they rounded them up. The ones that they knew were like animals or west because they would eat you. They would eat you. It was something wrong with them. Not only would they eat you, it did not matter if you were male or female or a towel. It was like, in their mind, something was wrong with the sexual part of their mind. It's like they used one part of their mind too much and not the other part. And the other part was left alone to be like a beast or something, you know? And so, the Hebrews, they locked them up. And put them over in caves or whatever. And somebody called it a Caucasian mountain. That's why they call themselves Caucasian. Even in the word Caucasian, I'm sure there you can find you and see United Snakes of assholes, and they are assholes because they take it in the ass and they like taking it in the ass, and they would do you like that or your thoughts like that. They would even find these pink people to be having sex with their animals, with their sheep, and with their goats. So they had to do something. So they rounded up those that they knew were like butte beast. And they put them over in the caves. And that's how they got over in the caves. There were not really many of them, maybe no more than 3,000, you know. All of the big people did not go into the caves, though. Some of the big people, they stayed, but they died out, you know, because no melanated man would um would have sex with them you know and they seem to be okay with in the mind about that and then there was another movie it was about germany you know why alistair crowley went over there and he wrote the scene and perpetrated and orchestrated the hitler you know live it was live a live movie there were non melanated men over there also living amongst melanated men and the non melanated men knew that they would die out but they were just glad of the days that they had and they treated each other well both sides they lived in a community together and they were very charitable toward each other and Hitler and Crowley he did not like that mm -mm.
He did not like that. They just don't like when we get along with melanated people. Non melanated people. They don't like when melanated people get along with non melanated people. You know, there were non melanated people who have the Black Panthers to put together a military because we were melanated. And in the only way back then, you know, we don't have militaries because we are sovereign people and sovereign, we are sovereign beings and sovereign beings do not need militaries because they are civil. You understand? They are civil and they are civilized. Only an uncivilized people need a military. However, the pink people showed them how to get a military, but the pink people did not kill off those pink people who showed the Black Panthers how to put together a military. They killed off the Black Panthers, and then they put the Black Panthers under this kind of bullshit that he is talking about in a whole different world. That world is the same as this world. You just don't see it. You'll be in this world. You'll be looking for it, and you will never find it. He said, if it's possible for us to do, who is this? United States, pink people. As they said, is, and then we were talking about them being put in the case. So how did they get out of the case? Well, as you know, the Egyptians are smart as fuck, right? They really, really are. They were. They don't know about today. But they were very, very wise men. They were so wise, they could put people under mind control. And have people think that they are Pharaoh and they are God. They were talking to you if you did not go for it. If you wouldn't run and say he is not Pharaoh, fuck him, you know. Fuck that nigga running run, run, run that dress. He did like his daddy ham, you know. Fucking men in the ass. That's why he has that little flap over so he can hurry up and pull it up front or back. You know they were nothing but, but ass worshippers and dick worshippers. You know, they say the Greeks were were black at first. Yeah, they were the goddamn Egyptians, dick worshippers. But pink people are dick worshippers too because the dad was melanated. He was a dick worshipper. Then he had Canaan. Canaan is pink. You know what I'm saying? They are dick worshippers also. So, now, many, many years passed. You know, and it appears that these people should be dead away in the case. You know, the Egyptians, they built boats. You know, they were the first builders of boats and stuff. The Egyptians were hamster doing that. They were very, very wise. So, um, he built a boat. He went over to these mountains and he saw them. And he saw how they lived and stuff like that. So, he went and he... Show them how to build a fire, how to cook their food. That's when they begin to cook their food, but they still ate raw meat, and they still eat raw meat today. Because you can take a Neanderthal out of the cave, but you cannot take the caveman out of the Neanderthal. No. Then, so the Egyptians bring them back, they come back. And then, you know, they override the Egyptians and kill them all and all that kind of shit, right? Now, during this time, before the generations of them rising up and killing all the Egyptians, there were melanated people having sex with them again, okay? And the Egyptians, they were gay like today. They were outright gay. They did not hide it. The Egyptians is the one that came to put the real hair in their heads. Yes. And they will kill someone to get the hair off their head. Or they will go and, and, and do magic. Like, if you are pregnant and maybe uh, you are from a tribe or something where you all had long hair, you know, they would come to... um touch your belly or do this or even touch your hair and then your child their child will wind up with hair like your tribe and your child will wind up with hair like their tribe shit like that has happened and it is still happening today because these people they are tricksters they are really really tricksters and they are very keen they are very wise 
So then the melanated people begin to have babies with them. And somewhere down the lane, Rebecca, who married Isaac, her grandparents or great-grandparents, one of the other male or female, was a pink person. And this is how she had two manner of nieces in her womb. And this is one that she birthed. The Jews. Who is Esau today? Who is taking our birthright? Taking our land? And they say that uh, Jacob stole their birthright. No. They have stolen Jacob's birthright. And I am Jacob. And they are Esau. Jacob's name was changed to Israel. Not Esau. So Esau is a thief. He is a liar. And here, they are pretending to tell you one thing, but they are telling us something else. You say God will contact the universe that he created almost immediately. Hmm. They always contact the universe that they created. They are playing around in it. There are many things we do that they have created that melanated people are not supposed to do, but we do it anyway. They created this shit. And then they won't let us create anything. Anytime we create anything, here they come, they take it. And next thing you know, they patent it. It belongs to them. <coughs> they become the household name. We become nothing. He does look like the guy that is for the windows. That's what he looks like. I cannot think of his name. But he's a household name too. He's just not a household name in my head. Hmm. But they speak of him a lot. You know, he did one of those, and then he said he tried to do a monopoly on it or some shit. Yeah, I have his ass in a montage too, the bullshit that he does. That's what he looks like. And then sometimes you do have to watch um, these people because they uh, do a lot of acting. That's all they are. They are actors. And they have one, They go from one foundation to another. And people get funds. United States funds. To their foundations, you know, and the word foundations is also fun. It's also, United States is also the word fun. See how smelly he is? He has smelled all the way through. And he laughs at the end. Now we go to loser to root. <laughs> yeah, he tells you if you pay attention, you are closer to the truth. This is a word here too. It should be looked up really. K U H N should also be looked up. Let me see. What happened here? K U H N. It's a surname of German origin. There you go. More mind control people. So then this man. This man here is a robber. A lot of them are coming from there. And I would think this here would be German too. You know what I'm saying? And then the word physics. When there's their income and there's the word S I C sick. Because they are sick. And Victor. They have the victory over the frequencies. And this is what he just explained how they have the victory over the frequencies. No, he wrote. 